Hello Year Sixers and a very warm welcome to the Performing Arts Department at ARC Burlington Danes Academy. My name is Mrs Egan and I'm Head of Performing Arts and I'm going to tell you a little bit about what you may well expect to study when you arrive with us next September. I say this because um, things look a little bit different at the moment. We do, however, have some fabulous practical spaces. We have a theatre, we have a drama studio, we have a dance studio. And wherever possible, we'll be back doing practical work in those spaces just as soon as we can. For now, this is what our performing arts curriculum looks like. You can expect to study one term of drama with a focus on live theatre and how elements such as lighting, sound, set, costume all contribute to creating meaning. We have one term of music and then we have another term of drama with a slightly different focus looking at page to stage, so how scripts can be realised on stage. So as part of your live theatre module, you can expect to see clips from musicals such as The Wiz, Billy Elliot, Grease and Matthew Bourne's Nutcracker. And the focus here is exploring how set, lighting, sound, costume and acting skills create meaning for our audience, how all these elements work together to achieve the director's overall intention. Then we move on to our music module and here we are looking at Stomp. We're going to build skills in rhythm, percussion, call and response, working as an ensemble and general performance skills. And our students at the moment are using upturned buckets to create these rhythms, which is very appropriate because as you can see from the pictures, the performers in Stomp use found objects such as bins. Then we return to our drama module, which is page to stage, and we look at two plays by Roald Dahl. To begin with, we look at the building blocks of performance. In voice, we focus on pace, pause, pitch, tone, intonation, accent and class. For movement, we explore body language, facial expressions, gesture, posture, quality of movement. And for design, we look at staging, lighting, props and costumes. Here's an example of one of our Do Now activities. You might already know the answers to some of these questions, such as what is a narrator, what are stage directions? And then we would ask you to choose three words to describe Mr and Mrs Twit before we go on to look at how the scene might actually look on stage. Then we move on to actually developing our characters through the play Charlie and the Chocolate Factory using the building blocks that we've already learned about. We look at the given circumstances, which is what um, we know about a character based on what they say or what is said about them. Then we use something called our artistic license. That's our own creative ideas to build a well-rounded character. We can compare and contrast the characters throughout the play. We look at what each character wants, what they're motivated by. And finally, we start to build towards some of our very own off-text improvisations and script work. <laughs> 